Hello, third grade. Here it is, channel 21 from unit 9. We hope you like it. Hi everyone! Welcome back to Channel 21. It's the last programme today. And it's the end of the school year too. Our school always has a fate at the end of the year. Last year's fate was fun. Let's watch a video about our school fate. A lot of people went to the fate. It was a hot and sunny day. There were lots of things for the children to do. In the morning, the children went on the bouncy castle. It was fun. Look at these children. They won a duck. It was great. In this game, people threw balls at a coconut. It was very difficult. Chloe's class played the throw a sponge game. How funny! A teacher painted children's faces too. She was brilliant at painting. Look at this girl's face. There were lots of delicious things at the fete. Mark ate candy floss. It was pink and sticky. There were lots of cakes too. In the afternoon, everybody watched a parade. There was a school band. The children played the instruments very well. Finally, in the evening, everybody watched the fireworks. They were amazing! It was a great day. At school, we always work hard to prepare the fate. All the children work together and we listen to everyone's ideas. Why don't you plan a fate at your school? Have a great time! Bye! Let's do some exercises now. We have to read and choose the correct picture. So we read the sentence and we choose the correct picture from the bottom. The children went on the bouncy castle. It was fun. Which picture do you think shows that? Picture number one, picture number two, or picture number three? That's correct. Picture number two. A teacher painted children's face. Which picture shows that? I'm going to let you think for a little bit. Is it picture number one? Is it picture number two? Or is it picture number three? You're right. It's picture three. The candy floss was pink and blue. It was very sticky. So, which picture do you think shows that? Picture number one, picture number two, or picture number three? Absolutely right. Picture number one. There was a big school band in the parade. The children played lots of musical instruments. Which, which picture do you think shows that? One, two, or three? If you need time, remember, you can always stop the video. That's right, 
It's picture number three. Well done. Everyone watched the fireworks in the evening. They were amazing. Which picture shows that? One, two, or three? Again, yes, picture number three. Good. Okay, now we get to a different exercise. This time you have to read the questions and answer them, okay? Choose the correct answer. Are you ready to start? Okay, let's look at the first one. What did the children do in the morning? Did they look at ducks? They looked at ducks or they went on a bouncy castle. Think about the answer. They went on a bouncy castle. Well done. What game did Chloe's class play? A coconut game or a sponge game? Think about it. A sponge game. Well done. What did Mark eat? Did he eat candy flows or cakes? What's the correct answer to that? Candy floss. Very good. What did the children watch in the afternoon? A parade or fireworks? What is the correct answer to that? Do you remember? A parade. Well done. And what did the children watch in the evening? The school band or fireworks? Think about it. Very good, fireworks, well done. We are going to listen and complete the dialogue. Are you ready to listen? Unit nine, video and 21st century skills. Activity book, page 99. Activity one, read and complete the dialogue. Listen and check. I want ice cream for one of the snacks. That's a good idea. Ice cream is perfect in the summer. What about candy floss? I'm sorry, I don't like candy floss. OK, let's choose another snack. OK, so I want ice cream for one of the snacks, says the girl. And then the boy says, that's... What do we put in that little box? A good idea. Ice cream is perfect in the summer. Well done. There you go. That is the answer. Okay. Shall we go to the next part? And then the girl says, mm, candy floss. What does she say? What about candy floss? I'm sorry, I... What does the boy say? Don't like candy floss. Okay, let's choose another one. There you go. That's the, com that's the dialogue completed. Shall we go to the last exercise? Okay, we're going to listen to the audio one more time to complete the notes. The notes that tell us the basic rules to be able to work in a team, to be able to work together. Let's go. Unit 9. Video and 21st Century Skills. Activity Book. Page 99. Activity 2. Listen and complete the notes. Good morning, class. It's the school summer fate soon and we need to make some decisions. Here are some tips to help you. Can you read them, Peter? OK. Tip number one is understand what you need to do. If you don't understand what you need to do, ask a question. Tip number two is listen to everyone's ideas. Listening to everyone's ideas is very important. 
And tip number three is take turns to speak. Yes, don't speak at the same time. Now tip number four. Don't be angry if people don't like your ideas. No shouting in this classroom, please. And the last tip is choose the best idea. That's right. Thank you, Peter. OK, everyone, get into your groups. OK, chicos, if you want to do this in your activity book, you're welcome to. If not, just think about those answers. What do we have to put in each one of the sentences? If you need to pause the video to think for a bit, just pause it. And here are the answers. Unit 9. Video and 21st century skills. Activity book. Page 99. Activity 2. Listen and complete the notes. Good morning, class. It's the school summer fate soon and we need to make some decisions. Here are some tips to help you. Can you read them, Peter? OK. Tip number one is understand what you need to do. If you don't understand what you need to do, ask a question. Tip number two is listen to everyone's ideas. Listening to everyone's ideas is very important. And tip number three is take turns to speak. Yes, don't speak at the same time. Now tip number four. Don't be angry if people don't like your ideas. No shouting in this classroom, please. And the last tip is choose the best idea. That's right. Thank you, Peter. OK, everyone, get into your groups. OK, guys, I really hope you liked this video. Have fun. Bye-bye.